Hey everybody, this week has been tough for me. Um, not this week, the Monday, the week before, because I'm re recording this before the Monday, so I can schedule it for the Monday. But um, yeah, this week has been really tough for me. Um, I've been doing BTEC work, and um, I've been doing a lot of BTEC work. I mean a lot of BTEC work, because I've got two BTECs. I finished my A-level exams ages ago. Not ages ago, but like two, three weeks ago. And um, and then I had just had BTECs. I've, why is that a bit echoey? I've had, there you go, that's better. I've had two BTECs. Um, personal finance or business finance, as some people call it. Um, yeah, I had that, and there's a load of work for that. Um, I also had forensic science BTEC, and that, is crazy the amount of work you have to do for that um but yeah so this week's pretty much inspired me to make this video um as you can tell by the title it's a moaning monday yeah we're in the negatives already um so yeah i i was doing all this b-tech work and i mean there's just in school, there's always these teachers. There's always some teachers, like, one marks really quickly, but she puts, like, loads of corrections. I mean, them teachers aren't that bad, because the corrections you can normally do, and they're quite, like, then you've done. You know what I mean? It's like, oh, okay, that's good. But then there's always the teacher or teachers. There's just like, yeah, I'm, I'll say I'll mark your work. I'm not actually going to. Yeah, I hate them kind of teachers. I don't say the word hate much, but that is one of my things. I just hate teachers that don't do marking. Um, one of my forensics teachers, I'm not going to name names, uh, to protect her identity, I'm going to call her Gerald. Um, Miss Gerald. Yeah, Miss Gerald. Um, I gave her loads of work. I gave her, I, I was doing past merit and distinction, obviously, as you do with BTECs. I did all the pass, um, I gave them all to her, like, two weeks ago, a week, two weeks ago. Yeah, I only just, like, a couple of days ago got the work back. Yeah. The good thing was most of it didn't have corrections on it, most of it was perf pretty good, so, yeah. But then, today, well, not today, uh, today would be Friday. Um, then on Friday, the teacher decides to go, Miss Gerald decides to go, Oh, by the way, um, if you give me any merit or distinction work, which is what I'm doing, because I've finished all the pass, I'm not going to be able to mark it on Friday. I'm just like, where? Like, where? Because I'm meant to be starting work, and I was meant to have started work the Monday of that week that I gave her all the work. But I had to delay my boss till the following Monday. And now she's telling me I have to come in the Monday. Because she's not going to mark the work until the weekend. She, and then she's going to give me the corrections on Monday. So that everyone else can get up to pass on theirs. And it's just like, what? Surely you should be focusing on the people that can be bothered to do their work. But I was like, I was like, whatever, I'll just go home then, I guess. And that's why I'm recording this. But yeah, um, literally it's like, she did no work, and then she was, be Miss Gerald was being shouted at by, like, other teachers for not doing the work quick enough and all this stuff. And yeah, it's just been a hectic week. Personal finance, I finished. Um, I had all the work done. I give it to the teacher. Uh, I stayed till seven in the afternoon because uh, he he had multiple students there. There was like four other students as well. I stayed till seven in the afternoon. Went through all the folders. There's six folders, so six units. Um, I did four of them up till up to um, two merits and two distinctions, and then the last two. We got the distinction on one of the last two just before we had to leave, but then halfway through Mark and the second one, we had to leave because the um, caretakers wanted to lock the school up and that at 7 o'clock. So um, I had to wait till the next day 
uh, Friday to um, be able to finish it. Uh, also, what's happened this Friday, it's officially the end of my school year. I've been at this school for seven years now. And um, it's the end. I just... It doesn't feel like seven years to tell the truth. Really, it doesn't. Like, apparently I've had this channel for like five, six years. Half the time I haven't been uploading on it, but it's like, it doesn't feel like that long. Because just as I, yeah, just as I got into Felton Community College is when I started my YouTube channel. Bugger. But yeah, so I've been there for seven years. Finally left. Um, so yeah, I mean, what else can you do? You leave, now I'm going to uni, hopefully, if I finish my forensics on Monday, which I should be able to, I got all the merit and distinctions near enough done, I should be able to finish on the Monday, I can't see why not, um, but yeah, I just need to then go in August and get my results for my sociology. And then it's off to uni. It's crazy. But yeah, so. Ooh. Hello? Is it me you're looking for? Right, that was weird. Um, I've got, obviously, I've got a motivational quote for you anyway, just in case. Um, I mean, I don't want to just be all negative all day kind of thing. So I've got an inspirational quote for you anyway. And it says, shoot for the moon. Even if you miss, it, you will still land amongst the stars. That was by Les Brown, a motivational speaker. So, yeah. It's a good quote. Um, it's relevant towards, like, school and stuff. Because you aim for the highest grade you can get like distinction star which is like what I got on my personal finance I got four distinctions two merits which is a distinction star and um I did really good I personally think um so yeah um aiming for a distinction star in my fi um finance in my forensics as well and yeah then I should be done really then I should be able to go to college college university but yeah, um, just in case you're wondering, the whole purple ball, uh, I'm now recording in my bedroom instead. And this was my sister's bedroom, but she moved out, so yeah, that's why it's purple. Not that it's a bad colour really, it's not that, uh, it's not that bright. Also, do you want to see something? Look, I'll turn you. But Keep out, gamer at work, killing enemies, beating bosses... Uh, stealing cards, explicit language, blowing stuff up, leave, oh, that way, leave food at door, enter at own risk. So yeah, I like that poster, it's good. I go on my door, so when my door's closed, bam, keep out gamer at work, even though my Xbox ain't in here, which makes sense. Also, I don't know where you can see it, the Minecraft poster. Minecraft poster. Copyright infringement. Um, so yeah. Thank you for watching. Motivational slash Monday. That's that. Like, motivational slash Moni Mondays. Today was a Moni one about teachers. Really. But um, it could be worse. I could be moaning about really boring things like... Nope, school's probably pretty boring. Okay. So yeah. Thank you for watching. Like and favor if you enjoyed, subscribe to become awesome today, and I will see you next time to watch the next episode. Click here. Here. To watch the last episode, click here. I don't know. I might put that the other way around actually, because that's I don't know which way this is gonna come out when it rec when it renders, it's probably be opposite. But to subscribe, click this face. Face. Yeah. I'm gonna zoom in so you can click the faces. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Do you want to, do you want to click my nose? Thank you for watching. Like and follow if you enjoyed. Subscribe. Don't become awesome today. And I will see you next time. Bye bye.